Hi everyone, I'm Lilia Luciano coming to you from our Los Angeles Bureau. Thanks for joining us. Here's a look at the top stories we're following right now. Ready to respond, President Biden says the U.S. is prepared should Russia invade Ukraine. What both sides are saying about a potential diplomatic solution to the crisis. And a possible invasion would impact oil and gas prices here in the U.S., how much the cost could rise and what people are already paying at the pump. Historic settlement, 10 years after the Sandy Hook massacre, a gun manufacturer is being held liable for the school shooting, how victims' families are reacting. And later this hour, Britain's Prince Andrew reaches a settlement with a woman who says he sexually abused her when she was underage, what the agreement reveals. Plus, another Hertz customer is arrested after the company claimed his rental car was stolen. He's speaking to us as he sits in jail. I am one of their best customers, and here I am sitting in jail. And it's, it's just completely absurd that any company would allow something to affect somebody's life. But first, President Biden revealed Tuesday there are now 150,000 Russian troops surrounding Ukraine. That's tens of thousands more than we previously believed. This comes despite reports that the Kremlin had decided to call some troops back to their bases. As Ed O'Keefe reports, the U.S. 